Long Range 341 here. And Phantom L25. And today we are smashing this Hitachi Desk Star 80 gigabyte hard drive. has a problem, it is broken right here on the board. The, the, the um, motor connector is fried. So, first Phantom, using the wonderful hammer, is going to take a hit at it. Okay, ready? Take a good swing. <laughs> oh. Okay, now I'm going to take the crowbar with the sharp end and just smash it. Wait, I've got an idea. Oh, Phantom has an idea? Okay. Oh, don't damage my crowbar. Oh, the floor? Oh, I used his name. Ow! You hurt yourself. Let's not hurt ourselves. Wow, that's hard to be strong. Let me use the sledgehammer. All right. Oh, wow, it's broken. Handle is broken. Yeah, that's old. Oh, perfect. Let's do the other side. Put the holes in the tarp. Oh. Really? Wow. That's powerful. Oh, goodbye. Oh, I smashed the plug. The plug is dead. <laughs> the bad plug is not dead. Oh, oh don't need that anymore. Probably doesn't even need solder. I want to tear that. You want to tear that? Yeah. Oh, the connection's really broken now. Yeah. Smash it right on the motor. Oh, we flipped it over. Oh, look at this. There's little pieces of the transistors and stuff falling off. But smash it right on the motor. That's probably really loud. Oh, yeah. Okay, I have the hammer now. Oh, this this hammer is really hard to hold. It's a sledgehammer. They're heavy. Oh, wait. Let's see how this turned out. Oh, it's all bent. And, oh, ha! <laughs> Look at it. That's ridiculous. Pounded the whole thing. If yeah. we can get this apart after we've done this, smash the uh, board a bit. If we can get this right. apart, right. yeah, put that put that right there on the board and just smash it like that. Hold that there so it doesn't fling about. Wait, let me move my hands. Oh, there's all the plastic bits. Whoops. <laughs> I found a problem. Here, I'll, I'll do this. Oh, look at this. The processor is a little... <laughs> the control board. You're gonna have to keep repositioning the dang thing because it keeps ah, running. I smashed off. my finger underneath it. <laughs> Don't hurt yourself. Oh, this isn't gonna come apart too easy. He's gonna peel off the. Uh, I think we have an issue here. I don't know why this hard drive doesn't work. <laughs> That's a lot of wiring. Yeah, it's all the little pieces of the processor chip. Oh. Phantom is angry. There we are. Phantom's angry. There oh. we are. Hey, look. Anyone need a SATA port? It's not connected to anything. Oh, kind of. If you need that one thing, if you know what that is. <laughs> Anyone need a transistor? <laughs> ah, there's pieces of it flying everywhere. Yeah, good thing we have a tarp. Yeah, good thing we destroyed a tarp. Uh, yeah, there are now holes in it. Just a few. Here, Small. I'm gonna hit the top. Both hands, it's time to make it. See if I can level that out. Oh! That fires with the drop. Ha! <laughs> 
Okay, I think it's dead. Yeah. Some, so the damage is pretty noticeable on top. And then you get to the bottom, and then parts of the board are pulled off because Phantom got angry and hungry. Um, motor smashed in. Oh, it's broken around the motor. Here, oh. give, me the, give me the crowbar. How was that? Now, this is what a crowbar is supposed to be used for. Probably not. Well, yeah, it's supposed to fry stuff off. Oh, this is really awkward, but... Just pull the chunk. Wait, gold! I can get the motor. Oh, it's gold. Probably. It is gold. Ooh, we've got a lot of copper, copper wire in here. Yep, it's an electric motor. Here, keep it on the, keep it in the frame. Let's even get this off and to get the motor out. Huh, I might need a clamp. Just so you know, we're not taking enough for safety precautions. We yeah. should be wearing goggles, and we're not. Yeah. And probably wearing some heavy-duty gloves. Don't try this at home, kids. The only precaution we have is the tarp, so we don't have to pick up a bunch of silicon off the patio. No, well, which there's already pieces of everywhere. Yeah, little pieces of metal and little pieces of broken. They're on the tarp. Yeah. So. That's all we have to do is take the tarp. The garbage can. I want that motor. Give me the motor. That long range is hungry. Hungry for copper. You split the whole thing in half. I split the whole thing in half, but I got the motor. Like this. Oh, the disc survived. Oh, what's this? The disc survived. How do you set it? It's a bit bent, but hold on, I'm going to this out. This isn't how you're supposed to remove the disc. No, especially because you can't really put it back it, in. The cool thing is, it's still mirrored. Still shiny. It didn't smash at all. This is this thing is a mess to clean up when it's... He's hitting it. This thing is a mess to clean up when it smashes, so we're really lucky. Yeah. We should smash it anyways. No. <laughs> Phantom doesn't want to smash it. I don't want to clean up that much. The filter stuff. isn't even smashed. But look at this, it's broken. Cracks in it everywhere. Broke the hard drive completely in half. It's perfect. There's also some magnetized dust, apparently. Yeah. It's bits of uh, magnet. Because there's magnets all over in this thing. Yeah. <laughs> That's weird. Look at this. Managed to get that off. Don't have to worry about getting pull it apart too much. The only stuff that's going to be in there is the arm. Uh, Wait, Phantom has another idea. You know, try to pry it off. Here, I'll hold this. You, you've hit the... Who needs a screwdriver? Look at this. The heads of the screws are just broken completely. Oh, there's a screw in the way. Oh. <laughs> no, it isn't. The arm. Hit that with a hammer. Another piece of it broke off. <laughs> Another piece of it broke off? The thing split. The arm isn't even crushed. It needs to be crushed. Oh, that... Okay, I need to get that. Okay, now the arm is crushed. The arm is crushed way back. I guess we destroyed a hard drive. Yep, hold on. Count the pieces. I know how to get rid of... Phantom, you're good at math. Count the pieces. Uh... That's a really strong... Oh, you broke it. There it is. There's some more copper stuff. Yep. Wait, the screw underneath this air pulled the board off. We should... Yeah, probably be wearing heavy gloves. Oh, yeah. Crowbar. Health and safety and parents. You probably shouldn't have been watching this video. Yeah. Get this arm off. Also, if you work at Hitachi, or worked at no, Hitachi... Well, just, just know that your hard drive you built was actually really good. It was good, until the connector went faulty. However, the motor still attached to the disc. Yep. Like I bowled the uh, copper... Out of the uh, arm. 
got the copper out of the arm. If you ever wonder how a hard drive is built, this is not the video for you. <laughs> no, because this is how a hard drive is destroyed. Oops. Poor old hard drive. We got another piece off, which seems there to be is, copper and plastic. And no one can forge any data off this because there's no data on it. And now, there is no data on it. I'm scratching it. Trying to hit me in the face. Scratching it up. Damn, this is a resilient disc. Got more. You got more? Yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, kind of shield your eyes back. Actually, it's just kind of bent. Yeah. There's nothing sharp on this thing. If you are on the assembly line that was that put these things together, you did a good job. Really good job. I mean, it doesn't work anymore, but... Yeah. So, that's it. Bye! No hard drive. The Doomsday Machine is designed to trigger itself automatically. It is designed to explode if any attempt is ever made to untrigger it. Oh, this is absolute madness! Why should you build such a thing?